Welcome back to the Olympic Zone. Now to the story you've all been waiting for, ski jumping <laughs> on Pilot View. Lee, tell us about it. That's right. Back in 1965, Ben was put on the map uh, nationally because they hosted the uh, 1965 National Junior Ski Championships, not only at Mount Bachelor, but right here on this hill behind us, Pilot Butte. Time for a little trip down memory lane. Let's turn back the hands of time to March 1965. Ben was not very big but it was quite important as far as winter sports go. All eyes were on Bend for the Junior National Ski Championships. One of the people who helped put on this event is this man, Frank Kamak. If you know skiing in Central Oregon, you know Frank. If you don't, you should. Frank is widely known as the original ski coach in Bend. We had a lot of parents and a lot of people at the bid ceremonies which were held in Wenatchee. We had, I think, 15 or 18 people from Bend that went up and gave various talks about why it should be in Bend and of course uh, Bill Healy was uh, very supportive of it because it would bring notoriety to Mount Bachelor that up to that point they really didn't have. And then we were awarded the bid when we had to face up to the amount of work it was going to take to put it on. When I met with Frank, I also had the honor of meeting one of the members of the 1965 Ben Ski Team, Sarah Larson, and she represented her hometown pretty well. I was totally surprised that I got fifth. Uh, I beat the other two gals in the team and I didn't know that I would do that, and <laughs> it was pretty nice. And then, and then they all went on to skiing Futures and I went to the U of O. <laughs> Any regrets about that? No. <laughs> the skiing, of course, took place at Mount Bachelor, but there was something else. There was a ski jumping competition at Pilot Butte. Well, that must have taken a little work. We had a group of people that bought a big air compressor and put in snow making equipment and felt they could make snow to snow it in, which never happened. So snowing it in became a total community project that lasted for three days, 24 hours a day. <laughs> and Gordy R. Robertson organized the trucking of the snow. So we had snow coming all the hours of day and night and people working on the hill, snowing it in. I just can't even imagine. I couldn't either at the time, and I was right in the middle of it. <laughs> it certainly was a march to remember. We want to make sure and thank Sarah and Frank for digging up these 8-millimeter films for us. We'd really hate to have lost Pilot Butte ski jumping. Ouch! That footage, absolutely amazing. So glad yeah. we can find it. And some of the ski jumping events in Beijing have already happened. Now Japan won uh, gold in men's and women's. Slovenia won the mixed team earlier this morning.